so friends today you are going to learn the very important topic and that is the common diseases and their affected body parts so not taking more time let's begin our session this is one hypertension and that is also known as high blood pressure bp and that disease affect the body part and that is our blood vessels and our heart friends the high blood pressure can damage the entire arteries and heart increasing the risk of heart disease stroke and even other cardiovascular problems so the hypertension that is known as high blood pressure bp affect the body part and that is our blood vessels and heart and the high blood pressure increases heart diseases strokes and even cardiovascular problems so that's the reason do not get so hyper let's enjoy life same time enjoy this video as well let's move on to the second disease and that is diabetes friends diabetes affect a body part and that is pancreas and blood vessels friends diabetes disrupts the body's ability to regulate blood sugar levels leading to complication like nerve damage kidney disease and eye problem so diabetes affects the pancreas and blood vessels this both body parts and it will increase the issues like nerve damage kidney disease and eye problem if it is not treated on time all right let's move on to disease number 3 and that is alzheimer's disease and the affected body parts is brain friends alzheimer's is a neurodegenerative disease that progressively impairs memory thinking and behavior due to abnormal protein deposits in the brain right so the alzheimer's disease affect the brain and it leads to have problems in our memory thinking and our behavior right so alzheimer's disease affect the brain let's move on to the disease number 4 arthritis and the arthritis affect joints arthritis encompasses various conditions causing joint inflammation stiffness pain with osteoarthritis and that is very common nowadays all right so the arthritis affect the body part that is joints and it leads some problems in the joints and those are like inflammation stiffness and the pain right let's move on to the fifth kind of disease that is asthma friends asthma affect a body part that is airways in the lungs friends asthma is a chronic respiratory conditions characterized by airway inflammation and constructions leading to shortness of breath and wheezing so asthma affects airways in the lungs and it also make a big problem if it is not treated on time and those problem can be shortness of breath and wheezing all right so let's move on to this this is number 6 friends if you find this session helpful then please do subscribe and share your comment at the end of this video let's move on to the question number 6 6 disease that is cancer friends cancer affect the body parts it can be various parts of a body there is no particular part it can affect any part of body the maximum parts of body cancer is characterized by uncontrolled growth of abnormal cells that leads to tumor formation or metastasis throughout the body right so the cancer affect any part of a body that leads for tumor formation right so let's move on to the this is number 7 and that is influenza flu and that affects the body part that is respiratory system friends influenza is a viral infection primarily affecting the respiratory system causing symptoms such as a fever cough sore throat and muscle aches 
So friends, the influenza affect the respiratory system and that respiratory system in future gets some issues and that is like a fever, cough and even throat problems and even muscle aches as well. Alright, so let's move on to the disease number 8 that is obesity. Friends, obesity affect the entire body because the obesity results from excessive body fat accumulation, extra body fat and is a, it is a risk factor for numerous health issues including heart disease, diabetes and even joint problems. So because of extra fat, excessive body fat that leads the heart diseases, diabetes and even joint problems. So take care of your food and take care of your body and be healthy and fit. Right? So let's move on to the disease number 10 osteoporosis and it affects the bones friends the osteoporosis is a condition where bones become brittle fragile increasing the risk of fractures especially in older individuals let's move on to the disease number 11 and that is chronic obstructive pulmonary as known as copd friends this disease affect the lungs the COPD includes condition like chronic bronchitis and emzema obstructing airflow in the lungs and leading to breathing difficulties. It also makes a breathing difficulties issues in our lungs, in our respiratory system. Right. So let's move on to the disease number 12, rheumatoid arthritis. Friends, the rheumatoid arthritis Friends, the rheumatoid arthritis affect the joints and immune system of a body. Okay, and it is an autoimmune disease where the immune system attacks joint synovims and causing inflammation and pain. So, the rheumatoid arthritis affect our joints and our immune system. Right, let's move on to the disease number 13 and that is Parkinson disease. Friends, Parkinson's disease affects our brain and nervous system. Parkinson's disease is a progressive a neurological disorder affecting movement and coordination, often causing tremorous and rigidity. So this disease, so this disease affects our brain and a nervous system that affect our movements and coordinations. Right? Let's move on to the disease number 14th and that is epilepsy. Friends, the epilepsy affect the brain. Epilepsy is a neurological disorder characterized by recurrent seizures which can vary from brief, almost undetectable episodes to serve convulsions. So epilepsy is a disease that affects our brain. Let's move on to the disease number 15th. And that is celiac disease. Friends, the celiac disease affects the small intestine in a body. Because celiac disease is an autoimmune disorder triggered by the ingestions of gluten and damaging the small intestines lining and impairing nutrient absorption. All right. So celiac disease affects our small intestine. Right. Let's move on to the disease number 16th and that is Hepatitis. Friends, Hepatitis affects a body part and that is liver. The hepatitis refers to a liver inflammation and can result from viral infections. Example, Hepatitis A, B, C leading to liver damage and potential cirrhosis. So friends, the Hepatitis affect the body part and that is our liver. Let's move on to this, this is number 17th and that is multiple sclerosis. Friends, the multiple sclerosis affect the body part and that is our central nervous system. Friends, the multiple sclerosis is an autoimmune disease that damages the protective covering nerve fibers in the central nervous system and that leads to various neurological symptoms. 
right so multiple sclerosis is a disease that affect our central nervous system let's move on to the disease number 18th and that is migraine friends migraine affects our brain and blood vessels the migraines are severe headaches often accompanied by nausea vomiting and sensitivity to light and sound and it lasts even for hours to days right so migraine affects our brain and blood vessels right so let's move on to this number 19th and that is eczema eczema is a disease that affects our skin eczema or atopic dermatitis is a chronic skin condition characterized by redness itching and inflammation causing scaly or oozing rashes on the body right so the eczema affects the body part skin and that causes redness itching inflammation and oozing rashes on the body parts right so let's move on to the disease number 20th and that is stroke friends stroke affects our brain and blood vessels a stroke occurs when the blood supply to the brain is interrupted either due to a blood clot or a or ruptured blood vessels leading to brain damage and neurological deficits deficits so friends the stroke affect our brain and blood due to not having proper blood supply to the brain right let's move on to the disease number 21 and that is hiv aids friends hiv and aids affect our immune system HIV weakness the immune system potentially progressing to AIDS making the body vulnerable to infection and cancers so the HIV and AIDS affect our immune system and make a body immune system very poor very weak that cannot even fight against simple common diseases let's move on to this number 22nd and that is gastrophageal reflux disease that is known as GERD friend this disease affect our stomach and esophagus so GERD is characterized by chronic acid reflux where stomach acid flows back into esophagus leading to heartburn and potentially damaging the esophagus right so it is a situation where the stomach acid flows back into the esophagus so that is known as gastroesophageal reflux disease where we get the heartburn kind of situation failing sometime let's move on to the disease number 23rd and that is lupus lupus is a disease that affect our immune system and multiple organs friends it is a chronic autoimmune disease that can affect various organs and systems including the skin joints kidneys and much more and many more so let's move on to the disease number 24th and that is hypothyroidism friends the hypothyroidism is a disease that affect our thyroid gland thyroid gland hypothyroidism occurs when the thyroid gland doesn't produce enough thyroid hormones let's move on to the disease number 25th glaucoma friends glaucoma disease affect our eyes glaucoma is a group of eye diseases characterized by increased and intraocular pressure which can damage the optic nerve and lead to vision loss so glaucoma affects our eyes and that leads severe condition of eyes where even a patient can lose his vision as well let's move on to the disease number 26th and that is ulcerative colitis friends ulcerative colitis affect colon and rectum of a body ulcerative colitis is an inflammatory bowel disease that causes ulcers and inflammation in the colon and the rectum leading to diarrhea and abdominal pain right so the ulcerative colitis affect our colon and rectum let's move on to the disease number 
and that is psoriasis friends uh, the psoriasis effect skin it is a chronic skin condition in which skin cell multiply at an accelerated rate causing red scaly patches and often accompanied by itching and discomfort so psoriasis is a disease that concern to our skin all right that even cause the red and scaly patches right so let's move on to disease number 28 and that is chronic kidney disease friends this disease affect our kidneys the chronic kidney disease results from the gradual loss of kidneys functions leading to an accumulation of waste products in the body and potential kidney failure so this disease affect our kidneys right and even it leads for kidney failure as well if it is not treated on time let's move on to the disease number 29th that is pneumonia friends pneumonia affects our lungs and pneumonia is a lung infection caused by a bacteria viruses or other microorganism leading to inflammation in the air sacs and difficulty in breathing so pneumonia occurs due to bacteria and even some of the viruses and it affects our lungs and it leads breathing issues in the lungs okay in the respiratory system so friends if you found this session helpful then please do support us by liking and subscribing our channel and please share your comment